One of the biggest complaints I get about camping in a minivan is that it doesn't count as real camping. Well, it's time to put those myths to bed and discover why minivan camping is just as legit as any other camping experience. As someone who's heard this complaint time and time again, I'm here to tell you that minivan camping is absolutely a great way to explore the great outdoors. In fact, it's an amazing option for anyone who wants to experience the joys of camping without sacrificing comfort and convenience. When it comes to exploring the great outdoors, everyone has their own preferences and values. For some, roughing it in a tent is the only way to truly connect with nature. But for others, the convenience and comfort of minivan camping is the perfect way to get started with camping. Now let's bust some myths about minivan camping and get real about why it's a legitimate way to explore the great outdoors. Some folks might claim that minivan camping isn't real camping because it isn't rough enough. But who says you need to suffer to enjoy nature? With a minivan, you can have access to modern amenities like a stove, a portable toilet, a mini fridge, and even a portable air conditioner without sacrificing the beauty of the great outdoors. Myth number two, limited connection with nature. Sure, sleeping in a minivan might not provide the same immersive experience as sleeping in a tent, but that doesn't mean you still can't connect with nature. You can always crack a window if you want to listen to the birds chirping or step outside to enjoy the sights and sounds of the wilderness. Myth number three, less physical effort. Some people might argue that minivan camping is less demanding than traditional camping. And while it's true that you won't be lugging around a heavy tent or sleeping on the ground, setting up a sleeping area and kitchen inside of your minivan still takes some effort. Plus, you can always hike or explore your surrounding areas to get your blood pumping. Myth number four is it's not authentic. Let's be real here. Everyone's idea of a real camping experience is different. Just because you're not roughing it in a tent doesn't mean you're not having an authentic experience. Minivan camping allows you to explore the great outdoors on your own terms without having to conform to anyone else's idea of what camping should be. Now I know some of you may still be skeptical about the idea of camping in a minivan. After all, isn't camping supposed to be all about the wilderness? But hear me out, because there are several reasons why someone might love minivan camping. First and foremost, minivan camping is incredibly convenient. With a minivan, you have a ready-made sleeping area and many other amenities that make cooking and meal prep much easier than if you were using a campfire. Plus, you can easily pack and store all of your gear and supplies without worrying about constraints. But in addition to that, sleeping in a minivan can be more comfortable than sleeping in a tent. If you do this right, you'll have a comfortable flat surface to sleep on and you're protected from the elements and bugs. And let's not forget about mobility and versatility. With a minivan, you have the freedom to explore and camp in a wide variety of locations. You can easily travel from campsite to campsite or explore different areas without having to pack up and move all of your camping gear. Plus minivan camping is incredibly versatile and you can use your minivan as a mobile camper during road trips or park it at a campsite for a longer stay. Additionally, many minivans can double as a daily driver. So you don't have to worry about owning a separate vehicle for camping trips. Last but not least, minivan camping can be a cost effective way to camp. While there may be some upfront costs associated with outfitting your minivan with camping gear and amenities, you can save money on campsites and lodging by using your minivan as a mobile camper. Additionally, you can save money on food costs by cooking your own meals instead of eating out at restaurants. So whether you're a seasoned camper or a first timer, it's time to embrace the wonders of minivan camping and experience the great outdoors in style. While most people tend to enjoy minivan camping, there are a few reasons that some people just won't like it. And the first reason has to do with what's inside. The space inside of the minivan is extremely limited. And if you ever wanted to find out what it might be like, to be a sailor on a submarine, this is the place to do it. You are confined to a five by eight by four space when you're inside of this vehicle. So if the weather ever gets really bad, you could be stuck in there with nothing better to do than maybe read a book or play some solitaire. That is of course, if you're rolling solo. If you have somebody else with you, 
that space is gonna be even more confined. So hopefully you really enjoy their company. And another thing is it might look like I have all of these amenities that are convenient for my setup, but this is definitely not as comfortable as what you would get in a dedicated RV. I very rarely use the stove inside of the van, so I always have to find a place to set that up when I wanna cook. And then of course, when you gotta go, this is the least convenient place possible. So I reserve accomplishing that task in the minivan for extreme emergencies only. This bed is very comfortable for someone who does not move a lot when they're sleeping, but it is the size of a cot. So when I'm rolling around in the middle of the night, I am confined to rolling in this little space and that can be a little uncomfortable. So the last thing you might not like about minivan camping is that when it's hot outside, no matter what you do, it's gonna be hot inside. And when it's cold outside, yes, your body heat will warm this area a little bit, but when it's zero degrees Fahrenheit, it's not gonna be very comfortable in here. But overall, this is one of my favorite hobbies and I wouldn't give it up for anything. So, if you enjoyed my video, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing and I'll see you on my next adventure.